Hey everyone, I'm Jay. Today we're watching the 10th episode of Inland Saga Season 2. Last episode we got some rather incredible Torfin character growth. The, uh, the dreams, the nightmares, the visions that he had were just unbelievable. They were, they were kind of insane, and I loved it. And, uh, yeah, let's see how long this newfound epiphany of his lasts. So, uh, yeah, let's do this. Three, two, one, go. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Hmm. Yeah, it was, uh, it was pretty insane. It was... Yeah, just visually, it was just breathtaking, honestly. It was the most incredible nightmare I've ever seen. With Asclad, it was like, whoa. <laughs> Yeah, let's see how long his uh, pacifist ways last. I'm not giving it very long. Like, the over-under over on that is probably like two episodes. I don't think it's going to last very long, but... Who knows? And I believe this episode we're going back to Canute? Question mark? I'm down for more Canute. That will never creep me out. <laughs> or it will always creep me out. Never stop creeping me out. That's what I was going for. The freaking scar just go. Oh, God, so good. So good. Oh boy, here we go, here we go. The cursed head. Oh, nice, nice. That is a good episode title. <laughs> All right, they're still chugging along. And ripped. <sighs> That's a big tree. Whoa. Whoa, nice. <laughs> He's smiling. <laughs> nice guy got all the stumps out and work the land and you're good to go. God, that's a time jump. Hmm. Next heart. Oh, nice. That ain't bad. Hmm. It's true. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> 
Yeah, that's the problem. Ooh, okay, going home. <laughs> yeah, not used to it. Not used to having freedom. Ooh, see a nice deer trunk. It's nice. <laughs> A lot more like everything you're not sure about. Hmm. Huh? Okay. Answer is no, but you can do your best. <laughs> you can certainly try. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh, don't have to wait for it to harvest. Nice. Wow. Good dude. I mean, considering who he this is a slave owner, you know, considering with that, seems like a good dude. <laughs> Forget Adar. Uh-oh. Till he returns, meaning he's not going to return. Death flag. Just got raised right there. <sighs> oh boy. Hmm. Trying to keep him around, huh? Hmm. Interesting thought. Hmm. 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 It's also say eternity in there. Okay. 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 Yeah. Birds. Birds.
<laughs> hey, it's Conehead. <laughs> yeah, that's right. No longer Prince Canute. King Canute. Oh my god, he's changed so much. I love it. God, he's had such a massive transformation. Like, off the charts. visually stark difference between old canoe and new canoe like Torfin I still see the old Torfin I'm sorry I still do he's still there <laughs> ah. Well, it ain't good. That's real bad. Three days. Close enough. Interesting looking game. A Canute flashback? Oh boy. Smooth. Yeah, that's also canoe. <laughs> right? <laughs> okay. He's like, I I'm not fighting, though. I'm like five years old. <laughs> Can I take a couple layers off? <sighs> nice scars in that dude's forehead. Holy cow. Got launched. Oh god. <sighs> there we the head. There be the head. As they should be. <laughs> mm, nothing, just all head. Previous king and all that. Okay, okay. Hmm. 
Okay. Okay. So. Oh boy. Mm. Oh man, he looks, he looks really rough at that one angle. That one angle looked like friggin' previous head. <laughs> looks like he's about 80 years old. And he's awake. I'll handle the rest. Oh, he speaks. That's been saving his energy. It's in your hands now. Mm hmm. Ooh. Hmm. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, that's horrifying. Oh, God. <laughs> so, Canute has his own demons. I love it. Mm hmm. This curse head's gonna drive him nuts. He's gonna snap. <laughs> Horrifying. Mm hmm. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's ill, all right. <laughs> Oh boy. All right. Hmm.
<laughs> yep. Yeah, he's very wary of everything. Yeah, paranoia. And honestly, it's smart. I mean, most kings didn't last very long back in the day. They died, they were taken out like that. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> I like her. Got some smoke. Yeah, he's getting driven nuts. Hmm. Oh, yeah. <sighs> wow. That is messed up. Yes, let's be friends with the said talking head. Great. Hmm. Maybe later. Hmm. Wow. Oh, it took him a while, but he got there. <laughs> <laughs> Can you even play? Oh my god. Ooh. Oh my god. Alright. There was a lot to unpack there. A lot to unpack. With Knut's psyche, I guess. He is... Yeah, clearly being... I assume being driven mad by the visions of the head. The cursed head, as it were. But at the same time, like, how is it really going to affect him, though? That's the question. He actually talks to the head, and if it drives him to go full conquest, 
Yeah. Then what? Then will Torfin have to fight against Canute? <laughs> will Torfin get dragged back into the war? I don't know. I don't know. There's a lot going on there, though, and I love it. And it took three years. Wait, so... The, so two years following where Torfin's like, yo, I'm done fighting. Because that was fall? Fall-ish? When that happened? And they said it took three years to do it, and that looked like next spring or next summer. Or spring or summer. So I presume it was two years since that point. Interesting. And swords. Ooh, ooh, I like it. I like it. So, they are going to be free upon sowing the seeds. But, <laughs> Master is leaving to go visit the king, who, by the time he gets there, will probably be dead. So, he will have to see Canute. I don't think he's coming back alive. I just think it's over. I think he's done. I think something's going to happen on the way. One way or the other. He's going to die. And yeah. That's my assumption. Because that was 100% to me. Death like. It's over. That dude is done. Oh. Yeah. What else? What else? What else? Oh yeah. He wants to keep on his retainers. I was like, huh. Yeah. He doesn't want to lose his incredibly hardworking hands. That's what that is. That's all that is. He's like, I want those guys to stay working for me. <laughs> That's all it was. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah. Interesting. Canoe with the head and stuff. Ooh. Ooh. God, that's just so creepy. And his brother totally looked like that head there for a second when they first showed him. They had that low angle. It's like, oh my god, he looks like he's 70, 80 years old in that same head kind of thing. But, no, then they changed the view and it was like, no, it looks more normal now. So, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I was seeing things or whatnot. Or maybe he was seeing things and I had to do a double take. Don't know. Regardless. Great episode. I love it. I can't wait for more. Let me know what you thought. Bye-bye.